Hey racers, John Racer3 here today back for the first video of 2020. Today we have eight beautiful looking cars here. As you can see, we have four Tomica cars. We got the Fry 488 GTB, the Lamborghini Huracan Performante, the Mercedes Benz AMG GTR, and then we have a Lotus over there. And they're going to be going up against some of the most beautiful cars in my collection the Fry FXXK. We have a Nissan Vision 2020 concept, we have a Bugatti Vision, and then we also have a beautiful McLaren P1 there holding up the Hypercars team. We have a Supercars versus Hypercars matchup on the Super 6 way down to the street track. Now, usually when I do street track races, it's only one race to determine it all, but for this one, since there are only eight cars competing, it'll be the first car to two wins, except for the finale will be first car to three wins, will be your champion. Let's go ahead and get started. First up, it's Ferrari versus Ferrari, the 48 GTB and the FXXK. Three, two, one. And look at that, it's going to be the 48 GTB taking the first win. Here we go, they've swapped lanes. Three, two, one. And look at that, it's gonna be the Ferrari 488 GTB taking the win, because the FXX, unfortunately, couldn't get started. Got stuck on the track. That is unfortunate. Here we go, next to up with the Lamborghini Huracan Performante versus the Nissan Vision 2020 concept. Three, two, one. And look at that, it's going to be close. The Lamborghini managed to stay ahead of the Vision. Very, very close race there. Here we go, they've switched lanes. Can the Vision bring it back? Three, two, one. Look at that, it's going to be close, but the Lamborghini has him on the road. That race was a lot closer than I thought, but the Lamborghini is going to take the win. Next up, we have the beautiful Bugatti Vision GT versus the Mercedes-Benz AMG GTR. Three, two, one. And look at that. It looks like it's going to be a pass for the Mercedes, as it looks like the Bugatti is not going to be able to go down the track. That is unfortunate. I don't think we have to do a second race, because he doesn't work in this lane either. So, yeah, that is an automatic buy for the Mercedes. And finally, we have a Lotus Exige RGT versus the McLaren P1. Three, two, one. Look at that, and the Lotus is going to spin around, but still manages to stay ahead of the McLaren. The Lotus gets the first win. Here we go, race number two. Three, two, one. And look at that, it's going to be no contest. The Lotus is going to destroy that McLaren. And here we go, Tomica is absolutely swept Team Hypercar, so now we're going to find out who the winner is out of the Tomica cars. Ferrari versus Lamborghini, and then Lotus versus Mercedes. I interrupt this video to let you guys know about my vlogging channel. That's right, vlogging channel. As some of you may know, I went on a trip around the world this summer and I made sure to vlog every part of it, so that is why what you're seeing right now is footage from when I went around the world. I'm going to start utilizing my vlog channel a lot more in these upcoming months. If you guys click on it now, I've been posting videos of when I traveled around the world, all the countries I went to, and there will be a movie coming out where it shows everything I did, everything I said, and all of that shenanigans from around the world. I'm going to start posting updates and like future funny videos on this channel, so if you could do me a huge favor, go down into the description, click subscribe on this channel with the bell notifications. I really want to share my life with you guys, and that is why why I started this channel so go ahead click that subscribe button right now it would mean the world to me if you click that subscribe button and if you do comment below and I'll give you a shout out in the video so thank you guys for watching now back to your schedule video here we go first up is the Ferrari 488 versus the Lamborghini Huracan Performante three two one Looks like a bad start from the Ferrari, and that's going to cost him the first race. McLaren is, or not McLaren, Lamborghini is up one. Here we go, race number two. Can the Ferrari bring it back? Three, two, one. Looks like another bad start from the Ferrari, and that's going to allow the Lamborghini to move on to the finals. Next up, we got that Mercedes versus the Lotus. Three, two, one. 
That Lotus is fast, but he's steered out by the Mercedes. Flies off the course. The Mercedes is going to get the first win. Here we go, race number two. Three, two, one. That Lotus has really got it on the acceleration, and it's going to be the Lotus taking its first win. We're going to a third race. Here we go, race number three. They've switched lanes again. Who will it be? Three, two, one. And it's going to be the Lotus with that sheer acceleration over the Mercedes, taking the win and moving on to the finals. So here we go. Here is your finale matchup. We have the Lamborghini Huracan Performante versus the Lotus Exige R GT. Let's see who takes it. Remember, it's first to three for the finals matchup. Who will it be? Three, two, one. That Lotus has the acceleration on the Lamborghini. It's going to take the first win. Here we go, race number two. Three, two, one. And that Lamborghini just doesn't have the acceleration the Lotus does. The Lotus is now up two. One more, and it's over. They switch lanes again. One more win for the Lotus, and it's done. Three, two, one. That Lamborghini got a good start, but it manages to fall behind the Lotus and is going to take second place in the tournament, leaving the Lotus to be number one. And there you have it, guys. The Lotus Exige R GT is going to take the win over the Lamborghini Huracan Performante. So thank you guys for watching so much. Uh, now, I did say in my update video that there is going to be a tournament of champions. So you are going to see this Lotus again when you see all of the 2020 champions battle it out. And that is going to be exciting. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.